اشرح لي ويسر لي امري واحلل عقده من لساني يفقهوا قولي ربنا زدنا علما ربي يسر ولا تعسر ربي وتمم بالخير اللهم اجعل القران ربيع قلوبنا ونور صدورنا اللهم امين الحمد لله we are going to start our Quran session after Eid break. So first of all, I will recap the previous lesson so that we should connect the previous with the new one. So we have started with level one and we have covered, I think, two chapters. So there are, this is level one. It is uh, the practice of the verb of three letters words. And the first pattern was uh, the first one is uh, chapter number level one, chapter one, Bab Fataha, Fataha Yaftahu, Fatha Fatha. Fataha means he opened. Level one, chapter two, Bab Daraba, Daraba Yadribu, Fatha Kasra. Daraba means he hit. And then we will go similarly. We have first six chapters should be on our fingertips. The third one is level one, chapter number three. Bab Nasara. Nasara Yan Suru. Fatha Dhamma. Nasara means he hug. Today, inshallah, we are going to practice on Bab Nasara. Level one, one chapter number four, Bab Samia. Samia yasma kasra fatha. Samia means he listened. Level one, chapter five. Bab hasiba. Hasiba yahsibu kasra kasra. Hasiba means he calculated, he computed. Last chapter is chapter number six. Bab karuma. Karuma yakarum. Dhamma dhamma. Karuma means he honored himself or he was honorable. So this is just a summary of six chapters. So I would start with Javad. Can you please just revise this summary of six chapters and then we will go for Bab Nasara in detail. Yes, yes inshallah. Uh, 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 Fatha 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 means he uh, he opened he, he opened yeah uh, and level one chapter two the uh oraba oraba yadribu fatha kafo oraba means he hit level one chapter three the nasara nasara yansu fatha damma uh, Nasara means he helped. Uh, level one, chapter four, Bab Samia, Samia Yasmau, Kethra uh, Fatha, Samia means he listened. Uh, level one, chapter five, Bab Hasiba, Hasiba Yafsibu, Kesra Kesra, Hasiba means he calculated. Uh, ba, level one, chapter six, Bab Karuma, Karuma Yakrumu uh, Dhamma Dhamma Karuma means he honored himself. He honored himself. So this was just a summary of six chapters. First, they should come in our fingertips. This should be the first thing. We have already done Bab Daraba and Bab Fatha with in detail. And important thing is examples. Uh, the similar example, just we have to fit on that. And also we have to build up our vocabulary. That is very important for Quranic understanding. To understand the Quranic verses. So today, inshallah, we'll start with Bab Nasara. Again, Bab Nasara is level one, chapter three, Bab Nasara, Nasara Yan Suru, Fatha Dhamma. First chapter is Fatha Fatha, then Fatha Kasra. Now we are on Fatha Dhamma. That the second letter, if you look at the second letter in Mahdi, that is Saad, it has Fatha. When the same letter goes to Mudare, you look at Saad, now it's Dhamma. So it is Fatha Dhamma. All those verbs 
Quranic verb which will follow this pattern. Fatha Dhamma, they will we will fit it in Bab Nasar. We have a lot of examples and they are mostly used. Very important chapter. You will see that we, we are using all this and we'll also take some example at the end. As in last class, I mentioned that actual purpose is that we have to implement these verbs in Quranic verses. At the end of the chapter, everybody will be able to translate Surah Al-Kafirun by using all tools, whatever we have learned so far. And that will be uh, one of the milestones we will achieve, inshallah, that everybody will be able to translate Surah Al-Kafirun. And we'll see that how the words are changing. If First say, uh, if question arise in our mind that why we are doing in this, just look at that. There is one word, a'budu. Same word, ta'budun, a'bidun, a'budu, a'bidun, a'badtum, a'bidun, a'budu. You will see the one word in different form is used. Their meaning will be changed. So we'll see that inshallah. So first let's start from here. That is Nasara. So I will ask... Uh, uh, Uncle Mia Hamid. Uh, his mic is mute, so I can ask someone else from here. Saad Iqbal. Assalamu alaikum. Wa alaikum Saad. Go ahead, please. Nasara. Nasaru. First, level one, chapter three. Level one, chapter three, Bab Nasara, Nasara Yamsuru, Fatha Dhamma, Nasara Nintihab, Nasara, Nasaru, Nasarta, Nasartom, Nasartu, Nasarna, Yamsuru, Nansuruna, Tamsuru, Tamsuruna, Nansuru, Nansuru, Unsu, Let on Tamsu, Unsuru, Let Tamsuru. Nasirun, Nasiruna, Nasirina, Mansurun, Mansuruna, Mansurina, Nasrun or Nusratun is for feminine. Nasara means? We helped. Nasarna. We helped. Tansuru. You help or you will help. Nansuru. We help or we will help. Unsur. Help. La tansur. Don't help. Nasirun. The one who helps. Mansurun. The one who's being helped. Nasrun or Nusratun. Uh, to help. To help. Thank you. Let's choose one more participant here from here. And I would go to Turhan. Assalamu alaikum. Wa alaikum as -salam, ya uh, Your task is the word halaqa. Halaqa means? He created. Okay, fit it here on Bab Nasara, please. Okay. Halaqa, halaku, halakta, halaktum, halaktu, halakna. In yan halu, yan uh, yeah. yeah, this is still confusion here. This is just a nasara. There is no noon. You always think about halaqa. So ha is first letter, lam is second letter, qaf is third letter. So it will be yahluku. Yahluku. Yahlukuna. Dahluku. Dahlukuna. Akhluku. Nahluku. Akhluk. Ah, no. Ah, wait, no. no, here first is Dhamma. Unsur. So it will be? Ukhluk. Yeah. Keep going. La. 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 Keep going. Ukhluku. Ukhluku. La. Tukhluku. La. La Tahluku Halikun Halikun Nasi. No, no, Halikun. Plural will be 
خالقونا خالقينا م م م مخلوق 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 مخلوقنا مخلوقنا مخ مخلوقنا مخلوقنا and خلق 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 creation خلق means he created خلقو who am he wait they created they created you created يخلقو you create or you يخ يخلقو he create or he will create. He creates or he will create. Ahluku. I create or I will create. Khaliqun. The one who creates. Mahlukun. The one. The who one who is being created. The, the one, one who is created. being created. The one who is okay. created. Thank you, brother Hamid Naim. Assalamu alaikum. Walikum assalam, Hamid bhai. You have to take the word shakara. Okay. Uh, with meaning or just straight? First, the fitted shakara and then we'll go to for the meaning in okay. Shakara, he was thankful. Shakaru, they were thankful. Okay, let's, do, let, let's do without meaning first. Okay. Shakara, shakaru, shakarta, shakartum, shakartu, shakarna. Yashkuru, Yashkuruna, Tashkuru, Tashkuruna, Ashkuru, Nashkuru. Uh, Oshkur, La Tashkur. Oshkuru, La Tashkuru. Shakirun, Shakiruna, Shakirina. Mashkurun, Mashkuruna, Mashkurina. And Shukr, or... Uh, Shukr, yeah. that's it. Shukr, Shukrun, Shukr. Okay. Shukrun. Shakara means? Shakara, he was thankful. And also its other meaning is he was grateful. Grateful. Yeah. Yashkuru. He is thankful or he will be thankful. Or Ashkuru. he is grateful, he will be grateful. Yeah. Ashkuru. I am thankful. Ashkuru. Ash I what is the meaning? I am thankful. Uh, Ashkurullah. I am thankful to Allah. Yeah. Ushkur. Uh, be thankful. Ushkurullah. Be thankful to Allah. Shakirun. Uh, Shakirun. The one who is thankful. The one who is thankful. Okay. And Shukr. That's the master. It's ah, the thanks. Like thank. The one who is being thankful. Is, is being thankful. Main yeah. I am okay. Uh, yeah. okay. Thank you, Ahmed. <laughs> uh, yeah, one thing, I am taking this class from your region, from your time zone. Oh, okay. Yeah, so you are, okay. <laughs> so you you are, are here? This, yeah, you are hosting okay, this class so... today. After the night. after the class, please okay, uh, I will talk to you, inshallah. contact me. Okay. My mic is okay now. Okay. Next, we will go to first um, brother uh, Hamad Shakil. He is going to teach us the second ayah. So I ask each and everyone, please just focus on this. And then brother Hamad, he will explain each and every word. And you will see that how we will use the verb and how we will translate, inshallah. Go ahead, Hamad, bhai. Azbillah min al shaytan al rajim. Faz kuruni az kurukum. Wash kuruli wala takfurun. So uh, we will see here this uh, Bab Nasara, and the word used here is uh, for uh, Zakara. Okay, so the Zakara is uh, from the table, Fail Amr is used, uh, which is Fail Amr plural. So, Uzguru, Uzguru, you all remember. Ni to me. Adkur, 
this is felun mudari uh, azkur or azkuru so i will remember kum you on wa and ashkuru this comes from the felun madi first verb shakara shakara mean he was thankful and this is ushkuru this is felun amar plural so you all be thankful li to me wa and la not takfurun this comes from kafara so kafara this is fil mudari ta is used here is takfuruna uh, yeah so just have to focus uh, yeah. sorry yeah yeah okay so so takfuru uh, takfuru this is um this this says fil mudari uh, this uh, fail on the third one, Takfuru. Oh, sorry, uh, Takfuru. This is, uh, yeah, it is, yeah. The, the way you were explaining, yes, we have to, in learning purpose, we should see like same thing. This is Takfuru ni. Uh, actually, this is, it should be Takfuru na. So yeah. it means noon is not part of that. Do so then do. we have to also see la. So la is coming only this. So it means it is la Takfuru. Noon is separate. Yeah, and noon is job because of the law. Yeah, this we is, will see that. This is la, let's take it as la takfuru. Yeah, la takfuru. This is felun, felun nahi, la takfuru. And then this is noon and ya. So noon ya, ya is job because it is ending here. And then we will learn it later why there is no ya. But the meaning would be the same uh, ni is used here. Same. Okay. Okay, now Hamabe, I will say the word and you have to translate in English. Fa. So. Uzguru. You all remember. Ni. Me. Azgur. Uh, I will remember. Kum. You all. Va. And. Next is. Ush will it be Ashkuru? Ashkuru Ush or Ishkuru? Ushkuru. Ushkur, because it is Shakara. Yeah, and this is Bab Nasura. Yes, Guru, so it will be Unsur, Ushkur. So Ushkuru, you all. You all be thankful. Li. To me. Va. And. La takfuru. You all do not. Uh, um, unthankful. Unthankful. Ni. To me. Me. Takfuru, what is the first word? Kafara. Kafara. Can you please start with Kafara and reach at La takfur? Kafara. So kafara, kafaru, kafarta, kafartum, kafartu, kafarna, yakfuru, yakfuruna, takfuru, takfuruna, akfuru, nakfuru, ukfur, la takfur, ukfuru, la takfuru. La takfuru. Kafara means he was unthankful. It is opposite of shakara mm -hmm. or he was ungrateful. Okay, now combine translation, please. So you all remember me, and I will I will remember you all, and you all be thankful to me, and do not be unthankful to me. Do not. Thank you very much. Jazakallah khair, Hamad. So see here, this is here. We are not using any translation or some. We are just using the tool. There are some things very important. First thing is uzguru, azkurkum. So see here, what is the word? That is zakara. Zakara means he remembered, and Uz, here it is Uzkur La Tazkur Uzkuru you all remember again this is Azkuru but it is Azkur come due to some reason inshallah as time pass we will explain about that knowledge why this is jazam there but actually it is Azkuru Azkuru I am thankful uh, to you all I will be Va and Ushkuru you all be grateful or be thankful this is remembrance sorry Li for me, well, see here, this is, there are two words. One is la takfuru, don't be ungrateful. And last thing is ni. Let me explain this ni. This is the same ni like this here. Now here question arises because we have just started and we said like kitab. Kitabuhu, kitabuhum, kitabuka, kitabukum, kitabi, my book. Rasuli, my rasul. Dini, my deen. But here... Instead of e, ni is coming. There is a difference. When there is a noun like kitab, 
and I want it to my ownership, kitabi, dini, noun. But when there is a verb, when there is a verb, you always we will use ni. Uzguru ni. You all remember me. You all remember me. This is the important thing to catch. Ni. Ni is for me. It is used with verb. For example, if I say, he helped me. Nasara ni. He created me. Halaka ni. So it is whenever there is a verb, any verb comes. So my, for myself, it will be ni. For example, if my question will be, he helped him. Nasarahu. He helped them. Nasarahum. He helped you. Nasaraka. He helped you all. Nasarakum. He helped me. Nasara. Ni. Ni will come with verb. And ya will come with isam. Noun. So this will be practiced. Similarly here, this is ni basically. Noon kasra ya ni. And you will see a lot in this Quran. Whenever the ending letter is noon, uh, hamza, vow, or ya, they will be dropped. Actually, this word is ni. But when it ends, this, these are the weak letter. Hamza, vow, and ya, they will not be there. We will see a lot of examples, inshallah. But this is la takfuru. You all not be, you don't be unthankful. Ni, ni. This is actually ni. So you all remember me. I will remember you all. And you all will, you all be grateful to me. Li, li for me. And don't be ungrateful to me. This is la takfuru. This is very important. Just we have to practice. Uh, so we have to go to the breakout room. First, we should know the chapter summary. The fataha, daraba, and nasara. Then we have to use all these verb and fit it here. And we have if time. So we have to take this ayah. So everybody can have chance to practice. Ringo out.